The Bonn Climate Change Conference closed Thursday evening after two weeks of intense work that made progress on several critical issues, helping lay the groundwork for the political decisions required at the UN Climate Change Conference, COP28, later this year. In addressing the gathering, UN Climate Executive Secretary said there are bridges that can be built to realize the common ground parties know exist. We have a commitment and we must all deliver on it. Climate change is not a North versus South issue. This is a tidal wave that doesn't discriminate. The only way we can avoid being swallowed by it is investing in climate action. And AGN Chair Ephraim Shitima reminded the developed countries about their obligation to climate finance, among other concerns. The delivery of climate finance will assist developing countries in just transition to low emission and climate resilient economies. However, the discussion on the redirection of financial flows opens the door to diluting responsibilities and allowing for greenwashing and even limits the implementation of NDCs. Mr. Shitima also touched on another key area of AGN's interest, just transition pathways. We must design an ambitious and comprehensive work program building on the informal note that acknowledges the different dimensions of just transition pathways with the goal of supporting the just transitions more effectively at the multilateral level. The Bond Conference brought together more than 4,800 participants from all corners of the world, almost double the number of participants that attended last year's conference. Indigenous peoples, local communities, businesses, cities and civil society, including youth, spoke about how they are addressing climate change and highlighted challenges that need to be overcome. Macpherson Mugukam, ZNBC News, at the World Conference Center in Germany.